Hello and welcome to this edition of Biology Bites. Now today I'll be talking about bass and their memory. Because I hear a lot of other fishermen talk and all the stuff about they have a memory and well just the other day I was out here and there's some spots next to the other dock I fish and I've been catching a lot of them on a brush hog and I happened to mention to my friend that I hadn't caught him in a while and his response was well you've educated him now. No, it's not that I educate him, it's just since the time I was catching them till the time I recently hadn't been, the water came up about another two feet, which meant there was a hell of a lot more, probably better places for them to hide. So I still catch one there once in a while, but now that the water's up, there's better places. It's, it's not that I educated them. Now that I've caught a few of them on a brush hog that they've told all their friends and they're not going to hit a brush hog. Because I have seen and read an interesting study on this, a study on, on bass and memory and lures. And they caught bass on soft plastics, like a plastic worm or the brush hog or anything that feels natural. And they could catch that fish again in five minutes. Since it ate something that felt natural, it didn't associate the being caught with eating something that felt natural. Because you might gotta remember, bass spend their whole life eating and trying not to be eaten. I mean, the trauma of being caught isn't really that much more of a trauma than them being picked up in the bill of a heron or, or tracked down by a cormorant or something that they escaped from. I mean, within five minutes after that, they're back to wanting to eat. But the interesting part about this study is when they used hard baits, something that didn't feel natural, uh, crankbaits, um, you know, hard super slew, you know, something that's hard plastic, has a bill, something that when you get it in your mouth, it just doesn't feel natural. It would take up to two weeks to catch the same fish on that same bait. Now you'd still catch them again. I mean, they do have some sort of memory, but it's, it's obviously short term because you could go two weeks and catch it and maybe another two weeks and catch it all in the same bait. But it's interesting that when tournament fishermen are, are using locator baits, which are usually hard baits, they either bend down their hooks or take the hooks off and then they get fish to bite and let them fight up for a bit and then it pulls out. And they think they're going to be able to go back and catch that fish in a couple of days when the tournament is, but evidently their memory is about the feel of it, not the trauma of being hooked. So if you're going to pre-fish, use soft plastics and you won't have to worry about it. I hope this helps. Uh, I hope this helps you realize that just because you're not catching fish on something you've caught them on before, it's, it's not that you've educated them. It's just they're probably not there because they're hardwired and they're like a computer. I mean, sometimes they'll hit things, sometimes they won't. It's not because they learned it. I hope this helps. Until next time.